guys, huwag kalimutang mag-subscribe at pindutin ang bell button para maging updated tayo sa mga latest happenings sa DepEd. Good day everyone! The Basic Education Services is now priority A4 in the vaccination ranking. The Department of Education thanked the President and the IATF for approving the appeal of Secretary Leonor Magtulis Briones to finally include basic education frontliners in the A4 priority vaccination category. From the Presidential Spokesperson, Jaire Roque, dated April 16, 2021. Priority Group A4 list approved Quirino Province still under MECQ. The Interagency Task Force or IATF approved on Thursday, April 15, 2021, the Priority Group A4 of the National COVID-19 Vaccine Deployment Plan. Priority Group A4 includes commuter transport, land, air, and sea, including logistics, public and private wet and dry market vendors, frontline workers in groceries, supermarkets, delivery services, workers in manufacturing for food, beverage, medical and pharmaceutical products, frontline workers in food retail, including food service delivery, frontline work, workers, workers in private and government financial services, and frontline workers in hotel and accommodation establishments. Also included in the priority group A4 list are priests, rabbis, imams, and other religious leaders, security guards, personnel assigned in offices, agencies, and organizations identified in the list of priority industries, sectors, frontline workers in private and government news media, customer-facing personnel of telecoms. Cable and internet service providers, electricity distributions, and water distribution utilities, frontline personnel in basic education and higher education institutions or ECIs and agencies, and overseas Filipino workers including those scheduled for deployment within two months. Frontline workers in law or justice, security and social protection sectors, frontline government workers engaged in the operations of government transport system, quarantine inspection, worker safety inspection, and other COVID-19 response activities. Frontline government workers in charge of task collection, assessment of businesses for incentives, election, national ID, data collection personnel, diplomatic community, and Department of Foreign Affairs or DPA personnel in consular operations and the Department of Public Works and Highways or DPWH personnel in charge of monitoring government infrastructure projects are also part of the priority group A4 list. The IETF likewise approved the continuation of the training of the national athletes of the Olympic Training Bubble in Calamba, Laguna, the extension of the temporary suspension of foreign nationals until April 30, 2021, while foreign nationals with valid entry exemption documents duly issued by the DFA prior to March 22, 2021, will be allowed to entry to the Philippines. Meanwhile, the IATF approved the extension of the risk level reclassif or classification of Quirino province under modified enhanced community quarantine or MECQ until April 30, 2021. Alamin kung bakit kang tumanggap o pwede kang tumanggap ng COVID-19 vaccine. So can I receive a COVID-19 vaccine? Find out here the latest guidelines for anyone who can be vaccinated. Una, yes, but need extra care. What are the the reasons? Leading rate sick or currently taking blood thinners? There is an allergy to food, eggs, or medicine. There is a history of asthma. Yes, but I reject at first. Currently infected with COVID-19 or symptom of fever, trembling, fatigue, cough, cold, headaches, throat or muscle, loss of taste or odor, difficulty in breathing process. There is uh, exposure to confirmed or suspected cases of the case of COVID-19 in the last 14 days. Received convalescent plasma or monoclonal uh, antibodies for COVID-19 in the last 90 days. In the first three months of pregnancy, got any kind of vaccine in the last 14 days, at 
admitted in hospital, had seizures or changed meds for comorbidities in the last three months, hypertensive emergency or blood pressure uh, greater than or more than 180 over 120 with symptoms of possible organ damage. Another level is yes but need medical uh, clearance from the doctor. May uh, autoimmune disease, there is a human immunodeficiency virus or HIV, cancer currently in treatment, chemo, radio or immunotherapy, getting under the organ transplant, taking steroids, stuck in bed or sick, sick with uh, that won't increase in six months. Not allowed includes less than 18 years old, allergy to vaccine uh, ingredients, example is polysorbate, PEG, severe reaction, example is anaphylaxis to the first dose of vaccine, and even if you have been vaccinated, don't forget to follow minimum public health standards or MPHS. Wear a mask, wash, avoid, and airflow. Reach your partner of the hero. Let's get together at the Star Buck Nation. Hello guys, wag kalimutang mag-subscribe at pindutin ang bell button para maging updated tayo sa mga latest happenings sa DepEd.